So like it, it, it that Aether buff is absolutely insane. It's like one yeah. of the most ridiculous things I've ever seen in Smash. Um, yeah. But outside of that, uh, um. I think I think Ike will still be pretty good offline because like he was a decent character before we saw MKLeo uh, make a couple runs with Ike before, and then um, and now he got buffed. So I mean, yeah. who knows? Maybe when offline comes back, we can see that was a very interesting interesting start from Vixel. Don't know what that was about, but hopefully when offline comes back, we'll see some Ikes uh, like Yez or Raven King. You know, make some d deep runs as majors. Yeah, I definitely wouldn't be surprised to see that at all because like it's been grinding out online this whole time anyway. So. Mm -hmm. uh, right there now we go yeah, we have that's, big that's, opening yeah that's really huge you don't ever want to get hit by arc fire especially because a good robin they know how to chain uh the arc fires so well mm -hmm. to lead the kills like you try to go for it there yep ended up getting that other hit though uh pop it out of the second one Did take a little bit of damage from it but still uh at those earlier percentages it's Doing a doing a great job, like 100% right now. <laughs> Ike just uh, hasn't really been able to get much going, but here we go. A little bit of something, but still. Oh, that aether, and there it is, man. That, that rage is gonna start playing a factor very soon too. If he can find a way to get another aether, uh, very soon could close out the stock very quickly, actually. Yes. Oh, wow. The trade in his favor. Another thing that was buffed was Ike's dash attack. I don't know why. <laughs> he was already incredibly strong, but apparently he wasn't strong enough. So yeah. now it, <laughs> it, 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 was an 8.0 patch, right? Yeah. <laughs> I remember seeing the notes for that, and we're like, okay, Aether buffed, dash attack buff. Why? <laughs> <laughs> oh, down tilt buff too. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Basically, what happened was um, they nerfed the range of when Ike's Nair up air actually kills. But they added all those other buffs, so it kind of just ended up working out. <laughs> right. Uh. Oof. Man, I didn't know the dash attack could actually go through the projectile like that. That's actually huge for Ike. He's yeah, not that's... necessarily fast on the ground, so he can get walled off by projectiles pretty hard, but he has a move that can just go right through it and potentially kill, then really good for him did you see that yeah that was strange i don't know what like why the thunder stalled in the air there for a second but <laughs> what was that that was <laughs> weird <laughs> i haven't seen that before. huh okay well anyway that was a thing that we saw briefly but yeah uh so far vixel doing a good job right here trying to find a way to make a comeback wow actually wow great arc fire into an up air uh hasn't been hitting this final stock yet that's i mean that's a good thing right now Almost actually sniping out the quick draw. That would have been sick. And there we go. Going to close out that last second stock. Excuse me, not last stock. Second stock with that forward air. And now we got an even game final stock here. Uh, Mega was sitting pretty, but Vixel just played that second stock beautifully. Yep. Took no percent whatsoever. Kept Ike in disadvantage for as long as possible. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, the thing is, man, uh, Robin's air to air is in this type of matchup are just so strong. And you already know, most of the time, the Ikes are going to be spacing by, you know, jumping in the air. But if he does that haphazardly, then he'll just get caught by Robin Levin Sword and be just put in a really terrible spot, as right. you can see. Alright, here comes Speaking of terrible spots. Yeah, you don't ever want to be in between Robin, Arcfire, and <laughs> the ledge. Yeah, really. Yeah. That's why you see the arc fire, the elf thunder, the down smash, because it covers a lot of situations in which Mega would have loved to like normal get up, roll get up, neutral get up, jump get up. I think jump get up probably being the only one that would have been good, just because you could probably get past arc thunder if you read it properly. Mega could have had a confirm there earlier. He had the down tilt and just did not. I don't think he buffered an option quick enough, and uh, actually just wasn't able to follow up with anything. It's kind of unfortunate. Yeah, especially when you're behind like this. You like banking on you know getting those early kills with the rage he has right now. Okay. Back row shouldn't kill here, right? Yeah. Nope. Just barely. Next one should probably kill. Here we go. We got that ledge hang going on. Not gonna be able to get clipped by anything, oh. but it does not matter. That forward air with the Levin sword is gonna be enough. That move is potent and will kill. Oh, an eight bit uh, eight bit man with the uh, rate of twenty eight. Oh, thanks for the raid, 8-Bit Man. Thanks for like always entering uh, tournaments, by the way. 
unfortunately, I didn't get to see uh, your matches today, but we appreciate your continued support, uh, Vince. Hopefully, see you again here uh, next week as well. Yeah, honestly, big shout outs to him. He's always reading the stream after his tournaments run, so I honestly greatly appreciate that. Uh, honestly, if you guys please sub, follow, give Ape Man your support, help keep his lights running. And also, you know, he's a great streamer. I actually enjoy seeing the clips he posts on Twitter, especially when it's, when it's against the Luigi. So, shout yeah. outs to that. <laughs> shout outs to that. Um, but also, guys, uh, consider subscribing as well and following here at 2G Gaming. Definitely helps keep the light on and the tournament's running. But enough of that. Let's go on to game two. P Vixel, sorry, versus Mega. Almost said Pixel. Close enough. Close <laughs> we had a, a Vixel, right? We have Vixel right here. And then there's another uh, player who was entered earlier named Vexel. You just switch the vowels around. That they were actually earlier in the bracket. They got eliminated uh, earlier in top 64. It was kind of weird. <laughs> uh, let's just be happy that Vixel and Vexel didn't have to play each other on stream. That is true. That is very true. <laughs> I would have just called them by the characters at that point. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so far right now we're seeing uh, Vixel kind of... Kind of off to a bit of a rough start here. Mega doing a great job. Oh, wait, no. I'm getting the percentages messed up. Vixel doing a great job. My bad. Uh, yeah, just, you know, doing uh, robbing things, getting those projectiles going, getting the combos out of them. So, I mean, so far, good stuff. Yeah, name of the game so far for Vixel is just... Not, I, when he's, you know, committing to these jumps, either by, you know, catching his landing or just meeting him in the air with the hitbox of his own. And right now, yep, doing a good job keeping that pressure. Even though they're at ledge, they're still applying pressure. You're just kind of inviting Mega to find a way to get in here. Oh, and there we go. That back air. I think the weak back air on the Levin Sword into the up air to close out that second. Our first stock. Excuse me. I am all over the place tonight. Woo! Oh, yep. Yeah. Vixel knows if he gets a... If he gets an area like that, especially on Ike's double jump off stage, very easy edge guard. Potential mm -hmm. stock, no matter like how early percent it is. Here we go, Mega trying to play a little careful here, but running into a couple. Oh, 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 oh Vixel, take it easy. Yeah, <laughs> definitely, definitely had, definitely had a guaranteed follow up there after the second arc fire, but he tried to go for you know a little bit more than uh, he needed to there. Luckily, he's still up uh, by quite a bit until he gets dash attack. <laughs> Never mind. See where they go from here right now. Vixel doing a good job. 74% on Mega. Mega gonna find a way in with an arrow, but never mind the grab. I'm trying to find a way to catch that quick draw. Oh, close. Nice cross up though, because that would have been caught by the Aether. Really good situation where Vixel's kind of just taking a stand, just going for projectiles. Understanding I also get the book at the same time, but also I have a lead here. Mega's the one who kind of has to come into that range in which she can do things like empty hop and neutral air. As long as I stay within whip punish uh, distance, I'll be fine. And there's that up smash, very strong move, but I think, I don't know if that was just input or just kind of hoping to get something. Oh, jeez, man. Vixel was looking for something there and just going to miss. But you know what? The fact that they're scouting something like that out, uh, it says a lot about what Vixel is trying to get going here. And uh, they're going to lose their Levin Sword for a little bit. And that was kind of strange. <laughs> the L Thunder is kind of scooped right over him. Oh, Dude. good Arc Thunder? Simply because you want to make sure you stop Ike from going for off stage for an opportunity like forward air, neutral air, down air. Or even force him to hold the shield like so as we see here. Oh no, but unfortunately you do leave yourself open going for an arc fire there. Okay. Good arc fire. Very, very close here for Vixel. Interesting, I thought we would go for a back throw to get some take control. Force an edge guard situation versus Ike. Oh. And again, the big air tears from Pixel, man. Every time uh, Mega commits to a jump unsafely, he's just getting swatted out of the air. And, okay, wait. Platform extension here for a little bit. Decent percent. Nice. Get up to that shield. And again, uh, yeah, Ike with Rage, man. Very, very scary. Oh. Yeah, um, one Aether out that ledge could have spelled curtains. Nice parry. There's, oh, like, I like that. You waited for the opportunity for the air dodge. 
to make sure you can secure the up air. Oh, that's gonna be it. Wow, okay, wow. Great L Thunder from Vixel finding a way to take that final stock there as Mega is trying to find a way back to stage. Gonna be able to take out that game too. Uh, so far, Vixel's really in the driver's seat here. I mean, it's kind of obvious they're up 2 0, but um, Mega's definitely struggling just trying to find like some sort of tempo to go off of. It's a lot of a like, it's a competitive game, like, because you're going to final stocks, but like, it mean, doesn't have momentum for the most yeah, part. Yeah, there's just, there's just nothing. Yeah, I agree. It, it's one of those things where it's it's hard to kind of get, oh, hold on. Both players have exited the stage, and I have no idea what's going on why. Give me just one second. Guys. Oh, that's top eight qualifier. Oh, yeah, that's it. Oh, yeah, I'm so sorry. I actually <laughs> lost that one. There we go. Yeah, I, I thought we were.